Hey girls and guys, it's Presley and today in this video I'm going to be telling you guys my little pedicure experience that happened a couple days ago. So I normally don't get pedicures or mostly manicures, but pedicures, I don't get them that often because normally I do my feet at home and I'm not that good at doing my own feet. Even trimming my own toenails, I'm not good at that. I'm always doing something wrong. So my grandma came over for like a visit, you know, and she thought it would be a good idea to just take me and her to get her toe, get her feet done. And I'm like, yes, cause you know, I don't go get, um, get pedicures that often. So we went to this very fancy place called Fancy Nails. I call it a fancy place, but it is fancy nails. I mean, you, you call it either way. They do like manicures, pedicures, waxing, all that stuff that normal nails places go do, do and stuff like that. So we both walk in, the both of, both of us walk in and the sweet lady, the sweet lady, uh, she's like, hi, hello, um, what are you here for today? And um, my grandma just just said that we needed two pedicures. And um, the sweet lady said, "All right, all right, uh, sign in right there and pick a colors." And and I and I specifically told the lady that I didn't want any colors because I don't like toenail polish or fingernail polish. It's kind of like me not liking makeup. I just don't like either one. So. The sweet lady just said, "All right, all right. Just take the, just take a seat on the far on those two chairs on the left. Those two chairs at the end at the left." And I and I did what she said. I went I went over to the um, the left to those far chairs while my grandma was just signing in, signing us in for our little appointment. And we had to wait until some 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 guys were coming in. We had to wait for them for a while. I was like, oh my gosh, when are they coming over? And uh, finally, these two guys showed up. And um, they put like little wrapping around the little um, little uh, thing for our feet. So it doesn't like get all dirty and stuff. And then he turns the water on. He puts like some sort of blue shampoo or something on in there. And then we just soak our feet in. And then he just clip um, those guys just clip our toenails, do stuff like that. And you know what's funny? He grabs like this little cheese grater. Look at I call it a cheese grater because I think it's pretty funny. He like gets a cheese grater, scrapes my my um, foot, like gets the dead calluses off, and I couldn't believe how much dead like calluses were on my feet. It was disgusting, but it was satisfying to get off, you know. It felt, it felt really good though. It did feel good. Um, but the most funny part was um, he was like cleaning my toes, of course, because um, he grabbed this specific tool. I don't know what it's called. He grabbed it and he got to my pinky toe and it tickled and he noticed. He's like, did it, did it tickle? And I'm like, yeah, it did tickle. But the best part, the best part about this whole, uh, this whole pedicure stuff was he he got two different types of oils, rubbed them both on my legs, and it, and it smelled really good. It smelled really good, and he grabbed some hot rocks. And, ooh, it felt so good, man! I never thought about it. Mm, hot rocks are just so amazing. That's just that's just the best part. My grandma didn't even get the hot rock treatment, and we both picked the classic pedicure. We both picked like. The classic pedicure. We didn't get the expensive one. I guess that she's getting her toenails painted. She didn't need the hot rock treatment, but I didn't ask for any like nail polish or anything, so they gave me the hot rocks and stuff. I don't know, but anyway, it took a while for my grandma to get her toes painted because I was done before she was done. So I had to. So the funny, the uh, the other part is. He, the guy was done with my pedicure. He was done with it. He he said, all right, uh, you can just go out and have a nice day and stuff. And I, I walked outside, went out to my grandma's car and waited for her. 
But the thing is, the guy that did my toes, he came back in and he said, just go back inside, there's a chair for you and stuff. And I'm like, oh, okay. I, just, I was waiting for my grandma and stuff. I thought I, thought I was going to like... Because he said have a nice day, like I was supposed to walk out the door or something, but there were some chairs out there for me because my uh, grandma had to get her toenails painted still. So anyway, she got her toenails painted. She had to pay and stuff. She had to like wear these like flat neon green like slippers or something like for her toenails so they could dry and stuff. She couldn't wear her regular shoes and stuff. She had to wear like these very flat um, um, comfort uncomfortable like paper mache shoes or something she didn't like them that much she thinks they're really uncomfortable anyway we were fit we were finished with our little little pedicure session it was really sweet of her and uh the sweetest part was she wanted to give my mom um a little gift certificate for her you know just for a little little surprise you know and I thought that was really sweet of my grandma, you know, giving her a little uh, certificate for when my mom wants to go get her toes done, nails done, whatever she needs done. Like, like my, my grandma, she's the sweetest thing in the world. You can't imagine. I got two grandmas. And uh, this, the, my grandma that I'm talking about right now is my mom's mom. And she's the sweetest thing in the world. You just can't imagine. She is sweet. I love her. I mean, who doesn't love their grandma? Come on now. I mean, if you don't love your grandma, then you you must be sick in the head. Or something like that. I don't know. If you don't love your grandma, then you must be getting a lot of whoopings. She's been, she asks you to get a switch off the tree or something. I never, I never get whooped. I never got whooped with the switch or anything. I'm serious. I never got whooped. I never got any type of lethal, not lethal, but any bad punishments or anything. Anyway, that that's a uh, that's my little uh, pedicure experience story, and uh, I just wanted to share with this this to you guys because you know I thought it'd be pretty funny to just tell you this story. My grandma think it will be pretty funny because, you know, she watches my videos every now and then and, does, and comments on them. And she'll probably think this is really funny, honestly. She'll really think it's funny. Anyway, like, comment, share, subscribe, all that jazz. And I'll see you guys in the next video.